Number one, y equals negative 5x plus 4. Remember the first step is we want to identify the y-intercept from the equation and then plot it on the graph. So I need to think about the standard form y equals mx plus b and that means my m is a negative 5 and my b is a positive 4. Now with the b remember that the y-intercept is in the form 0 comma b so my y-intercept will for this equation will be 0 comma 4 and then I want to go ahead and plot that so I go 0 in the x direction and positive 1 2 3 4 that'll put me right here for my y-intercept then that's part A. Now part B, use the slope from the equation to rise and run from the y-intercept and plot a second and third point on the same graph. So from that 0, 4, or this dot that I already plotted, I want to use a negative 5 to get my further points. So since it's not quite in rise over run form, I'm going to work on that. So negative 5 is the same thing as negative 5 over 1 and then remember I can multiply by negative 1 over itself and that will give me positive 5 over negative 1. So there's my two ways of looking at slope as rise over run so that I can find two additional points on my line. Now for the first one come to your your y-intercept and then I want to go negative 5 for my rise Oops. I want to go negative 5 for my rise and positive 1 for my run. So from this point, negative 5, so that'll be down 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and a positive 1. There's my first point. Now come back to the, the other form for my slope, which is a positive 5 over a negative 1. So from here, positive 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and a negative 1, 1, right to there. I have a nice little ruler. So I'm going to use my ruler and try to plot these points for us here. All right, so then when I'm ready to plot, I just start at one end. draw my line, put my arrows on each end, and there's my graph. 